Out of all the parks I'm visiting in 2023, even though I'm only visiting four new parks, these are some of, these are my top three most anticipated amusement parks I'm going to in 2023. I'm Horizon Thrills, and these are my top three most anticipated 2023 parks. Enjoy. While well, I visited places like Six Flags and the Dumb Wonderland, EMOTIONAL DAMAGE! These three new parks are some of the best. For the number third spot, it comes to Maury's Piers. While this park is right next to the beach, it doesn't have that many throw coasters. It has a boomerang, a SOC which is apparently the best SOC in the world, and a wooden coaster. I'm not a big fan of most wooden coasters besides El Toro and Phoenix, so that would be fun. I do, I did like boardwalk parks when I was VP, but now thinking about it, if you really pay attention, they're just dirty and a big mess. But anyways, let's move on to the number two spot. Enjoy. The number two spot takes us to the only other park I need to visit that's in Virginia, and that is King's Dominion in Dodgeville, Virginia. This park looks really nice because the entrance and the Eiffel Tower. The Eiffel Tower will be a great opportunity to get aerial footage overlooking the amusement park and there is definitely some awesome coasters at King Dominion, as in Twisted Timbers and R305. So overall, this park looks really nice and pretty. Moving on to the number 4 spot which I think everyone knows what it is. Yep, I'll get straight to the point. The number one spot is none other than Sesame Place in Pennsylvania. This park looks so freaking good. Okay, yeah, I'm joking. The actual number one spot is none other than Cedar Point in Sandusky, Ohio. This park is the coastal capital of the world, so you know I'm gonna like it. With the best OMC on planet Earth, apparently, to top the Jack Store, which isn't open, this park looks amazing. I'm most excited for Steel Vengeance since at the time of me going, Top of the Drag Store will not be open. I love how there's a beach on Cedar Point property. It will be amazing to relax on the beach after doing roller coasters all day. And Cedar Point is getting a new addition, which is well a wild mouse. I did not like wild mouse that much, but I guess that would still be fun. Well, that's my list. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't mind hitting that subscribe button. That really supports my channel. I'm Horizon Thurs and I'll see you guys on the horizon. Peace.